Amanda Barshanov once stated, The best gifts in the world are not the material objects one can buy from the store, but in the memories we make with the people we love. Today's episode is entitled, Favorite Gifts. When I was a child, my mom always told me, Angel, when you were born, all the angels came from heaven. Do you know why? Because you're special. On June 16, 2018, I launched my show, Have Faith, Let It Begin. I always wanted to change the world, share my personal testimony, share real life stories and motivational topics to set out to go out and change the world. Join me each and every week, Monday through Friday at 6 a.m. because this is a show all about faith. My name is Angel and welcome to Have Faith, Let It Begin. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Have Faith, Let It Begin. We are just getting closer and closer and closer. I think you're going to hear me say that a lot because <laughs> it's December, right? But it feels like every time I go on the internet uh, to buy a gift for someone, it says you have to order now because the time to get it in before Christmas is shorter and shorter. Yep, we're getting close. Folks, I want to welcome you to another episode. Today is a very simple episode. It's remembering our gifts. Now, we can look at this in two different ways. So today's version of remembering our gifts is actually the gifts that we got on Christmas. And then tomorrow we will talk about remembering what gifts God has given us. So right off the bat, oh, my microphone was far away. Can you believe that? Holy cow. I'm not going (laughs) to. Holy cow. Okay. Hold on a second, folks. I was I was looking for my microphone and I realized it was far away from me. Holy cow. Okay. Well, this is why I love my show. I don't edit. So the <laughs> Okay. Um, I don't even know. I lost my whole train of thought, everybody. I guess you can call that my very first blooper. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's start from here. The the gifts. Let's talk about the different I can't believe I did that. Let's talk about the different types of gifts uh, that we got when we were kids. Um, and I want you to participate. Join us on our social media account on Twitter. The descriptions are on the uh, on the actual info page. Um, join us on all of our different platforms: YouTube, um, you know, iTunes, uh, all the different uh, ways you can you know catch us. Spreaker.com, our like page on Facebook, um, and join the participate participation regarding the type of gifts that you have gotten. For myself. I think my two favorite gifts growing up, uh, number one was my He-Man collection. Love He-Man. He-Man was awesome. We did an episode a while back about cartoons. If you haven't checked that one out, go do so. Um, and of course, I'm showing my age again. He-Man was one of my favorite cartoons. And um, I remember my parents getting me a huge display case where I could put all my uh, He-Man dolls, or we call them now action figures. And man, those were fun. Um, And as I got just a little bit older, um, I started to get into uh, wrestling and the uh, World Wrestling Entertainment action figures. You probably heard the uh, heard me talk about that on my on our last episode on last Friday uh, entitled The Gift from God and how I was excited to get those gifts. As I've gotten older, you know, the gifts obviously get different. They get more uh, personal. They get more um, interactive. Uh, you get more gift cards. You get an opportunity to utilize those to buy your own gifts. What gifts have you been re- have you been given as a child that you can still remember? Do you still own those gifts that you were given as a child? I can raise my hand right now and say I do. Um, what are the things that you liked most about receiving those gifts when you were young? Was it the feeling of knowing that it was the one gift you waited for or that you were good for? This entire year? Was it the feeling of knowing that everybody around you had the action figure or the or the Barbie doll or the or the uh, Raggedy Ann or the Cabbage Patch Kid? Oh my gosh, I'm really showing my age. Um, talk about those gifts with us. Share with us. You know, they always have this thing on social media called uh, TBT, Throwback Thursday. Let's throw back, you know, Christmas gift today. I know some of you out there always participate 
We've got Chip. We've got Ashley. We've got Brian. Freddie. Um, we've got, um, uh, uh, let's see, Barbara. Uh, Barbara. We've got uh, Carol. We've got so many people out there that constantly reach out to us. Um, and I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm asking all of you to just take part of it. Um, this episode is not meant to be uh, long. I just want to throw this out to you and tell you that gift wrapping um, is not my greatest, not my greatest gift by any means. I am the worst at gift wrapping. Um, as a matter of fact, as we talk about gifts, I remember my father is notorious for leaving the tickets and the hangers still, still on. And uh, he would just throw it in a box, wrap it up, and give it to my mom. That's our biggest uh, joke almost every year. Um, I think he's starting to get better at it. Now he, do, now he doesn't include the, uh, the hangers. He just leaves the tickets. Um, share with us some of your you know, happy moments, happy times um, during the holidays. What do you do on Christmas Eve? You know, what do you do on Christmas Day? Um, as I got older and you, know, you get married and then there's in-laws involved, you try to um, alternate uh, visitation days. You know, sometimes people go to their main families on Christmas Eve and then Christmas Day they go to their in-laws' house. Um, I know for myself, we kind of do a little bit of both. Um, we do Christmas Eve at my house and then Christmas Day uh, when I'm off, I actually try to host a brunch, um, you know, where everybody comes over and we make breakfast. This year we're doing a theme party uh, for, uh, for our brunch. It's going to be called uh, Pajama, P- Pajama Brunch. So... I guess all I'm trying to say is the holidays are fast approaching. All of us have good memories. Some of us, not so good memories. Hopefully, we can share the good memories together. Hopefully, we can enjoy future memories in the years to come. As we get closer and closer to closing out 2018, I'm asking each and every one of you to share your good fortunes, share your good stories, share your gifts that you received, and I'm going to bring them up in the next episode as we close out the week this week. And I leave you with this. Even though we talk about a gift, even though we talk about things that are bought for us on the holidays, remember that we have so many different types of gifts that God has presented to us. He has given us the gift of talent, the gift of patience, the gift of prayer, the gift of life. Utilize those treasures, those gifts, those talents that have been given to you by God and spread them to the world. Tomorrow's episode, we'll be talked about a gifts God has given us. But for now, share with us what your favorite gift was when you were a child. If you have a favorite gift now, share it with us. We really want to talk about it. For Have Faith, Let It Begin, my name is Angel. And next time, I'll make sure that my microphone is with me. Bye-bye, everybody. <laughs> Thank you for listening to another episode of Have Faith, Let It Begin. As the holiday season fast approaches, you're going to hear episodes of me recording live as my daughter in the background, Ariel, will probably cry. You'll hear background noises like phone calls and right on the cue, she's starting to cry. Don't worry, everybody. We're going to continue on like never before. And with Ariel in the background, knowing that the future, you're going to hear yourself crying like this, mama. Yeah. Say hi to everybody out there. We just want to encourage each and every one of you to join us every single weekday, Monday through Friday at 6 a.m. Join me, Ariel, my family, and everyone as we continue our journey. For Half Faith, Let It Begin, my name is Angel. Say goodbye, Ariel. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> bye.